was wrong. Rewrote the song. Thoughts become action. Tell me what's happening. What's your mind wrapped in? Wrapped around. Wrapped, wrapped around. Wrapped, wrapped around. What's Hey guys, welcome back to Click. This is Im, and today we're doing a quick unboxing and review of the Spigen Magnet Air Vent Mount, as well as the Spigen Thin Fit Hybrid Case for the iPhone 6s Plus. Um, I initially picked up one of these air mounts for my wife uh, and realized that it was working fantastically. It's so easy to use, easy to install, and uh, so finally decided to get myself one for my car. Uh, and I figured why not uh, pick one of these uh, thin fit hybrid cases. Uh, looks pretty thin, easy to install, and one of the better cases that Spigen offers. Into the uh, magnetic air vent mount, and let's open it up and see what you get inside, okay? I'm just going to pull back here and open up the bottom so that it doesn't make a mess on my table here. And so when you open it up, you're going to get, uh, let's see here, everything's stuck together via the magnet. So this here is the uh, actual magnet. This goes on to the air vent for the um, car, okay? And you get two different magnets. You get a small uh, round one, okay, along with a slightly larger rectangular looking one. Uh, now Spigen also gives you uh, some protectors for the magnet when you're putting them on your phone. You get the round one for the round magnet and the square one for the square one. Okay, uh, so that's what you get in the box for this. Uh, now in terms of uh, installation, demonstration, whatnot, I'll see how it goes. Uh, if you guys really want to see what it, how it works and what it looks like in the car, uh, just uh, leave a comment down below and I will be happy to do a quick video demonstrating how it works. So let's get into the um, thin fit hybrid case. Let's just open it up here. Okay, so pretty straightforward Spigen packaging. Uh, when you open it up you get the case there. Nothing else in the box. And you take it out of the bag let's see what we get inside we get the Spigen certificate of authenticity we get some uh, poison for the trolls now there's an insulation guide in regards to how this works so let's get it out of the uh, case okay so there's a spot here for the actual magnet for the mount now, I'm not going to actually stick it in here because I always switch cases. So, um, But basically, if you wanted to, you could uh, stick this in here and then put the phone on and away you go. Uh, and then just when you're ready to go, all you would got to do is just slap the, the, the case right to the mount. And this should be in the car and away you are. Okay. So, let's get into the case a little more anyway. So it's a two-piece case uh, with ultra-thin uh, back plate, okay? And you can see here it's got the normal cutouts from the bottom and the sides and for your camera. It's a soft-touch black plastic and it feels really good in the hand. So this is the side rubber piece and you can see the area where you're going to, the black panel is going to actually connect. So let's get my iPhone out and uh, see what happens, all right? Okay, so here's my iPhone. It's got nothing but a skin on it, so let's see how this looks. So let's put on the rubber portion first. Okay, see it's pretty good. It's got the metalized buttons on the side, a spot for your uh, mute vibrate switch, and then on this side you've got the power button and your normal cutouts for your headphone jack, charger, and this case actually redirects your sound to the front so you get better sound quality and no muffling when you're holding it from the bottom or the side when you're watching any movies or playing any games alright so let's try and stick this on and please excuse me if it gets a little shaky I'm tr I'll do my best while being behind the camera here but I might need to pull back just to uh, get this going so hold on a second here my apologies guys but pulling back makes things much 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 easier 
you just have to clip it on. It is a little bit stiff getting it in, um, but once it's all clipped together, uh, seems to look and work the charm. So here we go. So this is the case uh, all put together. Okay, and you can see how the back panel, and I haven't installed it completely perfectly. I'll have to do that again after. But the fit is really good. The f quality of the build here looks really nice. The buttons are pretty easily clickable as well as the power button. Okay. And as I said, the ports on the bottom, the sound, and as well as the finish, there's a nice uh, shiny finish on the edge of the actual bumper, which looks really good. Okay guys, so here we go. That is my uh, quick unboxing and quick review of the uh, ThinFit Hybrid case and the Spigen Air Mount case. Well, not case, but air mount for the car. Uh, if you guys have any questions, any comments, please do leave them on the bottom. I'll leave links below for these items if you guys want to know where to get them from. Okay, thanks again for watching. Take care.